Hi guys, Cranky Cows here. And a Shirtster. And we're back with what will either be the penultimate or the final part of Death Stranding. Not sure how we're going to edit these uh, final cutscenes, but shall we just get going? Go for it. Hopefully the squish will give us a bit of quiet time. We made it. Oh, we made it. Thank heavens you made it. Fragile's been in the coma oh. for a while now. But with hmm. all these crypto biotes you brought, crypto biotes. we should be able to bring Not her up. And with any luck, it'll only take a few more to get her back on her feet. You did well, Sam. Oh, thanks. I don't really feel like I did with that final boss, but um, you made it through. I made it through in my own special way. <laughs> And then managed to get a game over straight afterwards because of the car that being destroyed. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was like 99% damage, yep. wasn't it? 99% damage Whoops. to the container. Or cargo itself, there you go. See, it takes a special skill to uh, achieve that. Mm. And make it through, I think. See. Hmm. Ouch. Did you expect anything else? I wonder what the lowest score you can get is. I think C is the lowest. Is it? I think so. Well, it's the lowest I've it's seen. either that or F, yeah. Yeah, C or... No, you cocked it up. <laughs> C for cocked Maybe that's what C, C is. C for cocked it up. Sam. Don't touch me, woman. Oh, but I so want to hug you, she's like. It must have been one hell of a journey, especially on your own. But now the whole team is together again. The whole team? Die hard. Oh, yeah, too. he is kind of stuck on a beach somewhere. Well, last we saw, anyway. Too much traveling to and from beaches in such a short span. True, Amelie could have got him by now. contaminated her mm. cells, effectively Ooh. causing jet lag on a molecular level. Because mm. of that, her homeostatic mechanisms were shaken. Don't worry, she's not in any danger, mechanisms. but she needs some rest. Sounds vital, anyway. Her organs? So where's the director? He's being looked after in another room. Okay. Bridges personnel found him lying outside the isolation. So he's not on the beach anymore. Similar to when you came back oh. from Cliff's beach. So oh, he's been good. ejected from the beach somehow. Did Cliff rescue him? She needed more and more time to recover. Maybe. Hopefully it'll become clear. Ah. The scent was enough. <laughs> Sam made it. They're gross. <laughs> Putting in a quiet taste, isn't it? Maggoty. <laughs> I don't know why I'm holding the controller, because like, unless there's going to be quick times or stuff, I might just put it down. Looks like you need me after all. Who'd have thought? Watch me lose a quick time now. Anyway, clock's ticking. Am I right? Yep. Sam's here. The great deliverer. The only one who can reach Amelie's beach. Uh, oh. You're in no condition to do this. She's really not. No. It's not fair to you or Sam. Uh, um, in my own search for Amelie's beach, I have come to realize something extraordinary. If beaches were likened to a multiverse, hers would appear to exist on a higher plane than ours. What, so she's like a god? I can Sounds walk the like beaches it. of others, but hers is beyond my reach. Okay, how's she done that? It's invisible, <laughs> inaccessible, even to fragile, I fear. Uh, imagine it as a circulatory system, if you will. Each of our beaches is a single capillary. A blood vessel? But is Amelie's that? beach is the heart that pumps blood to the rest of us. Mm. Capillaries okay, are then. subordinate to the greater whole. Wait, but what the if... The whole governed by the heart. If we kill her, though... Direction, which dictates flow, which dictates... Everything. Is it a good idea to kill her? Everything. Doesn't sound like it. Mm. She is in control. Hmm. Is she messing with us? may be able to travel against the flow and reach her, but having done so, if she does not wish to let you go, if she wishes to keep you, 
she can. Fragile and Die Hardman broke free from her beat, didn't they? I don't think it was any different from what happened to you. I didn't get out because I wanted to. She let her go. I was forced out. Repatriated, oh. if you will, by her. Oh, right, okay. Forced out. Why? Didn't want you there. But this is only a theory, but she wants you. Wants you to go to her. Why? That's her final wish, don't you think? Hmm. So she can create the extinction with him so together? That's it, huh? Amelie's the EE -E and this is her. Or is game. Sam the EE? -E? Just so we're clear. If I want to stop the last stranding and come back in one piece. Is BB the umbilical cord? I need to go to her beach and talk her out of it. Is that about right? Correct. As cliche as it sounds, you're our only hope. Though, quite frankly, I doubt even you can change her mind. Positivity! <laughs> make her see reason. You'll have to kill her. And if you kill her... You'll save the world. But you'll be stranded outside of it. Well, that sounds rubbish. Forever. Marvelous. We're stuck in a beach limbo. Sounds like it. Or something along those sorts of lines. He's going to get the dream catcher, isn't he? But we know we're not having another boss fight because you guys have said that that whale thing was the last big boss fight. So I feel like it's going to be one of those like press X to win if we do have to fight her. Mm. You know, like not a quick time event, but like a press this button now. Or well, she'll be standing there just like. Do it. Yeah. Do it, and you just like right, or something like that. Maybe. Official then. You ready to deliver the package? Deliver me. I'm really sorry, guys. I'm gonna have to get a tissue because my nose is streaming. Here you Thank go. You. <laughs> oh, BB. I'll talk to her. Yeah, we will. Maybe she'll listen. For two hours. But with the shape the world's in. It will only be delaying the inevitable. Still, if it buys us time to try and build something better, a new lease on life, at least for a little bit, well, I can think of one woman who made the most of a chance like that. Fragile, she's going to be the, the new leader. Nothing forever, not even the world. But we got to keep it going as long as we can, right? Patch the holes, change the parts, all that. So we can say we had a good run. That we lived. Listen to him giving like such a I motivating like speech. Because <laughs> it was hard enough keeping my own shit together. Back when we met at the cave, the only thing I cared about was making it to the next sunrise. Sure as hell didn't care about America or the future. I was living a lie, hung up on past regrets. I was broken. But somewhere along the way, I started changing started meeting people that made me think that maybe it wasn't Aww, all bad. Sam, no. you big softy. People that put their faith in tomorrow and in me. That kept the lights on and waited for hope to arrive. So I gotta deliver for their sake. Even if it means you never come back? Fucked if I do, fucked if I don't, right? Eloquently put. Take care of Lou. Oh. I will. Couldn't find a working still mother east of Port Knot City. Kids done and all. No more. All right. I'll do my best to nurse our little one back to health. If anyone's gonna look after Lou, I'm glad it's Mama slash Lochner. Come on, let's do this. Okay, concentrate. Help me look for Emily. 
I'm nervous, even though I don't think I'm going to be doing much. Mm -hmm. Reach for her, Sim. Feel her. I know you love her. You love her. There he goes. Is Fragile gonna be okay? She's still weak. I guess we'll find out later, potentially. We will. There she is. Sam. You came back. There you are. Again, she looks massive. Maybe it's just perspective. Hmm. So at the moment, she thinks we're on her side, right? Yeah. No idea at yeah, this point. Yeah, yeah, she does. Unless she's all seeing. <coughs> what the fuck? Are we a child now? Well, a baby. thinking back to all our interactions with her over the story. She's basically a lying bitch, so where are you taking uh, me as a baby? Are you sticking her in water? Are you drowning me? Exactly. Sam Strand. So this episode is about us. And that's our real name. You just noticed that the C on the left looks Looked a bit red. red. <laughs> yep. Um, is oh, that the whale. blood that's of the whale. whales? That's yeah. a fuck Blimey ton of neck. whales. Oh god. Emily's Beach. Beach. Right, looks like you have control again. I have control. Oh, I do not let... Stop, Stop the extinction. Find Emily. Uh. Are we looking towards the sea because that's where we need to go? I'm just going to run into the sea then. I feel like I feel like that's a way to go. Don't know if it's the correct way, but I mean... Maybe you need to go on the whales so you don't sink. I, I don't know. But does it carry on? I don't know. I feel like... Ooh. Ooh. Is that sort of hinting at the direction you need to go? It looks like it could well be. Or you're almost... Uh... I'm going to drown, aren't I? Oh. Okay, okay, good. Not that way, then. Let's just have a little swim back to the shore. You can stand up, you know. I thought I'd just... Uh... <laughs> You've got all that. Do that. Okay, let's have a look at our map and see. Oh, we can't. Amelie. Oh, I can call her. We're along the beach. Yep. Hey, Amelie. Oh, this is creepy. Where are we? Where are we? Anybody out there? Anybody out there? there? Out there? Um. I don't know what to do. Hey, I'm a lead. Why do I get the feeling there's that um, sort of things for left, like islands, mountain thing in, Where? The, in the sea? So look that way. Oh. oh. Oh, okay. Did you tell him to do that? Nope. Scripted. Well, at least I think it is. Yeah. It looks like it. And in 
She's controlling all this shit, so we weren't going to find her if she didn't want to be found. True. Okay, she's wearing black. Ready for the extinction? The funeral of the, the uh, has world? Begun. Is that Bridget? Oh, could be Bridget. She's, she's got a gun. Yeah, she's got a gun. Die Hardman's gun. What took you so long? Your voice. It's Bridget. You still don't know who I am, do you? Who are you? Oh. Sam. I knew you'd come back. Is this the aged Emily? That's dead Bridget, isn't it? Or dying Bridget from the beginning. Could be. <gasps> listen to me. Oh, God. <laughs> you ready for a quick time? Yeah, true. <laughs> Could be a kick in the face. I love you, Sam. Do that, Bridget. And there's Emily. Oh, she's be waiting for you on the beach. She's fucking with us. Yep. They're waiting for us on the beach. We're on the beach. I've been waiting for you. Right here ever since. You were supposed to stop me. Stop all of this. Bridget? Yes. It's me, Sam. Oh, because Amelie is not really real, is she? Where's Amelie? Because Bridget couldn't have kids. Mm. Where she's always been. Nowhere. So she's like a weird... Oh. My daughter, Samantha, America Strand, doesn't exist. So she doesn't even actually really exist. Amelie doesn't exist. So this whole time it's been Bridget. In your world. Only on the beach. Sam. to wear a mask for so long. Amelie and Bridget are both a part of me. What's this supposed to mean? Quiet, and I'll tell you. There is no time We've got a lot of cutscenes to get through. <laughs> listen. Just listen. Okay, I'm listening. I hope all this makes sense by the end of it. I don't want to be like, what the fuck? After two and a half hours, I you know? think that's what we're going to be feeling, though. Oh, really? I reckon. Just a hunch. Hope not. I hope to be proven wrong. You guys have said it's a great you story if you stick Sam? with it. I hope you're not wrong. Amelie and Bridget. Those are just names. What I am is an extinction entity. So, knowing what you know now. You have two choices. Uh, I was getting shot, one of them. You wouldn't come back if it happened here, you know. You'd be straight on to the afterlife. But no. It's not. Okay, like good. That. So why are you Killing aiming a gun at us then? A terrible mistake. Is she going to turn it over to us and we have to decide whether to shoot her? And do we actually get a choice? Yeah. The last stranding has already begun. A seam has formed from my beach and the beaches of every soul in America. And soon it will be inundated by a vast surge of antimatter starting here. That doesn't sound good. Nope. In a flash. That's that sounds a bit like a black hole. It does, doesn't it? Consumed by an explosion. Big Bang. 
So that brings us to your first choice. Oh, are we gonna get a choice? Do nothing. Stay here with me and bear witness to the very. Why well, do I wanna fucking stay with you, you lying bitch? Just watch it burn. Together with me. Nothing about you is real. Until the last flame wakes up. No, I want to go back to Fragile. Fuck you. Doesn't sound so bad, does it? That's my feeling, anyway. Mm -hmm. I think your choice is already made, by the sound of it. I mean, if that is a choice, who is choice. going to choose that first choice? In expanding the network, you brought people and their beaches together, integrating them into a greater whole. Like this Kipu. But in doing so, you also bound them to my beach. The very beach where I opened the gates to the other side. So I've doomed them all, basically. I think that's what she means. But if you cut me and my beach loose, perhaps you can stop it from spreading. Easy decision, mate. You might just prevent the last stranding. And mankind will live to die another day. Sounds good to me. And it doesn't have to end here. But it does. The beach is doomed no matter what. Everyone's gonna die at some point, I'm but to tell you why that. do it early? Mm-hmm. <sighs> Which is why we must sever our connection. That'll be it. The end of the death stranding. can't stop the inevitable. The sixth extinction will happen either today or tomorrow. You can either end it with dignity, quick, nope. clean, and in a flash. Mm, that's not what humanity does. We're gonna go out or kicking and screaming. in vain, knowing full well what's waiting come the finish. Those are your choices. kept it all this time. Perhaps you still have a chance to stop this nightmare. You brought the world together. You have the right to decide. Pull the rope or cut the noose. But whatever you do, don't hesitate. Um. I'm ready, Sam Strand. Okay. Make your choice. See ya. Do I have to do something? Wait. Do you think? I don't know what to do. I do. Sure you do. After everything, how could you not? Don't fuck it up. Uh. Right, you probably haven't got all the time in the world. Okay. Uh. That. That didn't work. That didn't work. Make a decision and bring. Nobody did. Him. Shit. Shit. <laughs> Seem to have no effect on Bridget in the beach. So I mean. Strander, have you got your strand? Uh. No. No. You've got nothing. She hasn't given me a choice, the bitch, unless I can hit her with it. Smack her. No, smack you with it. How do I smack her? Unequip and punch her. How do I unequip it? Fucking hell. She's not letting me unequip it either. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hug. Hug. I'm gonna kill you with love, damn it. I'm here for you. Always. Did you have the choice then? Like you were for me. Well, it doesn't look like it, does it? Unless I could have just left and let her walk. But then that was... I don't know. Here. Uh, it's a dream I hope that hasn't just done an ending I don't want. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you.
I suppose when I did have the option of not pressing R2. You'll need it mm -hmm. to make us whole again. And when the time comes, you'll have to stop me. You are the only one who can. Promise you'll remember. Baby Sam is so Sam, cute. Sam, <sighs> I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Can we strangle her, please? I remember. Yeah, you okay, remember. break her neck now. <laughs> I did and I didn't. I had so many dreams of the future. I didn't know which ones to trust. Which is why I decided to share them with you and the others. But to connect the dots, to make sense of everything, you need perspective. That's really significant that he's gone time. to hook her, though, isn't it? Hmm. When he doesn't time. touch anyone. Has no meaning to me. I am not a line. I am a single point. Which is why all I could do was just show you choices and let you decide. Our nightmares are your dreams. You found the common thread. The strand that links them together. And you did that the only way possible. To live life one day at a time. Thank you, Sam. I'm still really confused as to whether I had any choice in that bit. <sighs> a gun won't help you here. Clearly. Yep. As we found out. Still has a role to play. Right. Was that the connection? It was the bonds yeah. between people that brought the world together. And if that is what matters most to you, then I will stay here on this beach. And I will shut myself in and the rest of you out. Shut yourself in. Come on. Once the last stranding starts, it can't be stopped. I can't go with you. All I can do is try to spare you the worst. Why do you have to stay on the beach? Sam. I am the beach. Okay, so we've achieved what we actually want to do. Sounds here. like it, yeah. I'm sure that the extinction happens. We've Even changed her mind, time. sort of. For hundreds of thousands of years. Alone? That sounds crappy. Hmm. That's what an EE does. <sighs> if I had just done my job, none of this would have happened. But I... I couldn't take it anymore. So she I got wanted so tired to help. Of waiting, and I figured that no one would blame me if I just got it all over with. Make things easier for everyone mm. and herself. Kind of feel sorry for her, That's even though she wanted to murder everyone. That's quite good. Sounds like hell. That's quite good writing. But you and the others came together, connected. And you may be living on borrowed time, but you still have hope. Before each of the big five, life rebelled. They fought back, evolved in order to survive. The extinction isn't just an ending. It's an opportunity. And if I have to pay the price for that, to be the sacrifice, then so be it. <sighs> Even if we aren't together, we will always be connected. Oh, she's pushed me back into the water. Sending you back, Bob looks of it. Back. So I wonder if, if we hadn't followed her into the water, 
whether we would have got like a shit ending. Maybe. Or whether it just would have, something would have happened that would have made it happen anyway. She's left the bridge, baby. And the photo. Oh, the photo. Be stranded with love again. Why is he looking all blue? Grey and blue, yeah. Oh, why have we got the bridge, baby? Yeah, why are we blue? Oh God, you help you here. Shoot the bridge, baby. What shoot the bridge. Have I gotta try Does and it? shoot this thing. Well, maybe not. Yeah, I'm gonna get control. Make a decision and bring this to an end. Make a decision to do what? I mean, what? Can you equip the gun? I haven't got anything. Norman Reedus. Why is it doing credits? What is going on? God damn it! I'm a lead. Oh my god, it's rolling credits. I'm stuck on the beach. You know what? I'm gonna go out. I'm gonna walk into the water. Try and do something. No, I'm gonna accept my end. Oh, hang on. Or do I? Oh, oh god, I don't know. Um. So what decisions could I make here? Like, I could walk into the water, like they do in feminist novels, and, and accept my fate, or take charge of my destiny and, and kill myself. I might just get carried back to the beach, to be fair, but I, I could make a decision that way, or I could make a decision to just sit on the shore. I don't know. What can you do with the gun? That's what I, I want to I know. Can't, I can't do anything. It's it's basically just walking now. That is all I can do. I can punch the air. I can shout at Amelie. 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 She's not answering, dude. I'm just gonna I'm gonna walk into the water. I don't know where that bridge baby went. We're gonna see what happens. Right. You're getting taken back. I'm getting taken back. So, I mean... That's that. Or is it? Or is it? <clears throat> I'm going to have a little explore. There's stuff over here. What's, what's that noise? I don't know. This is kind of disconcerting. What a strange ending. I love it, guys. Like, somebody in the comments, I'd be worrying about it because somebody in the comments said some guy they watched finished the game or they hadn't actually finished it and they thought they had. And, and I don't want stopped. to make that mistake. Well, it looks like you're getting something. Quiet, and I'll tell you. There is no time for questions. When you were young, you used to have bad dreams. You cried about them all the time. The truth is, those weren't your dreams. They were mine. For as long as I can remember, I've dreamt of the beach. Not just while sleeping, in my waking hours too. In my dreams, I watch the world end so many times. Right. Countless past extinctions that decimated life on this planet. Again and again and again. At first, I didn't understand what I was seeing or why. And that wasn't the worst of it. There were other, more terrible... And I'm stuck in one. I get it. ...of death and destruction. Of a massive extinction to come. And I would always be the one to end it all. 
to bring about the last strand. As I have. Okay. Today. Um, let's get up. Let's go. I'm not sure where to. I'm aiming for this mountain area. I don't know why. I, I don't know what I'm hoping to find. There's strands up here. We tried the water approach. So I'm guessing maybe that guy who ended it early saw credits rolling and thought, oh, that's it. Um, I'm guessing it. I'm and guessing didn't, case, didn't yeah. do all this stuff. But yeah, we always like to sort of make sure we play it till, you know, the very end. The basically. bitter end. The bitter <laughs> end until we get a sort of, this is what you can do in the post game. And I know there's post game stuff in this because I think that's chapter 15. So we are carrying on, don't you worry. What? Ooh. Oh, I thought that was a tar pit. That's well, he's going to go jump in the tar. <laughs> that's just beach as well. I mean, I could head up there, that valley. I sort of feel like you're going to get on the beach again and he's going to sit back down to rest and he might get a bit more of what... What, go to the beach again? Yeah, maybe get down here and see what happens. I don't know. He sat down just out of the blue before, didn't he? He's tired again. There, there you go. go. The first operation. I was only 20. Oh, with her cancer. I opened my eyes and found myself on the beach. Bridget's the physical body and Amelie is the mind. So mm -hmm. I came yep. up with a story. I told people that Amelie was my daughter. Can you stop walking around in circles and get my dizzy? My daughter with a debilitating condition and an absent father. Look. Amelie. Is it written in the sky? Oh, you're writing it. Am is French for soul. Ah. Lie. Soul, that's a lie. There was no Amelie. Only me and the beach. Very clever. <laughs> I thought it was a curse in the beginning. But later I started thinking. Maybe I can use this. I tried to find out more about the beach. Because understanding the beach had to be the key to interpreting my visions of the future. Please don't keep doing that. It's like you're going for a bit more of a walk. Can I save? No, no. I can't save. Oh god, we're in this for the long haul then. Looks like it. Great! So now what? Keep walking till he gets tired. Or running in this case. Yeah, let's run along the beach. So you're saying that it's chapter 15 that is the post-game post stuff. Game, We're yeah. still in 13. We still have another chapter about yeah. it. So in order to get through the end of this game, we've had to, we're, we're thinking we're going to have to split our recording sessions. So we're recording on a lunchtime. Um, and then we're hoping to finish it off tonight and just stitch the two episodes together. But obviously we've got stuff to do, so hoping it doesn't... I mean, it doesn't go on forever. Go yeah. on forever. Like, hopefully we can sort of... There's an autosave at chapter 13's end. Here we go. Right. If not, I'll just have to pause it. 
Yep. So you can actually do some work this afternoon. <laughs> oh. Now what? Did I get oh. to the edge of something there? Oh, oh you back? Are we back? Yeah, we're back. Ugh. You can't go too far. We'll send you back. Mm -hmm. Strands up there on the right. I honestly Very think faint. it's just a case of running while yep. the credits roll. Ooh. Oh, you don't always get the option to double jump. I didn't know that. No. Maybe you had to be doing a specific thing mm. to trigger it. Can we shoot ourselves with this gun? I realized the beach was connected to the world of the dead, which meant that somewhere out beyond it were the memories of time itself, including those of every organism that had ever lived. 4.6 billion years of biological history, a history that might even stretch back to the creation of the universe. The chiral network and everything that followed was born from my pursuit of that knowledge. By passing data through the beach, okay. we were unbound by the restrictions of time. So you're trying to help Simulations us? Simulations that would have taken years or more were simple and effortless. But then why destroy everything it all early? Everything Earth had lost and forgotten could be reconstructed and reclaimed. Are you trying to encourage shortly us? shortly after we began our research, America saw its first void out. I thought I was running out of time, that my nightmares were becoming a reality. So, I raced to complete the chiral network as quickly as possible. The past held all the answers. If only I could find a way to piece them together. A network that bridged our world and the beach. <sighs> that might do it, I believed. So, I started researching bridge babies. Children bound to the world of the dead. Such a creepy concept. Mm -hmm. What causes an extinction entity to come into being? What was the reason for the previous five mass extinctions? Good question. The answers to those questions would tell me how to stop the sixth. I founded Bridges, more determined than ever to build a chiral network that would cover all of America. But the longer I fought my war against the inevitable, mm. the weaker I became. My hoe had cancer. Mm. The beach's punishment, maybe. For not playing along like a good little EE. -E. And then, just like that, my hoe was gone. And we I went and incinerated it. We did. So, I asked you to do it for me. And you did. You helped us complete the network. Helped us to reclaim everything the universe experienced from its inception to this moment. Every mystery was ours to solve, like this one. Once, there was an explosion. A big bang that gave birth to time That's and space. That's the speech Things. of the intro. It was more mm -hmm. than a big fluke. All that matter and antimatter should have cancelled itself out. And yet, leaving nothing. the world was created. But somehow, somehow a tiny speck of matter survived. Just enough. Enough to make this world and everything. So is that the aim here? A world that Try and get that to happen again. Balance. Order inevitably gives way to chaos. Everything that lives Wee. must inevitably die. It's like the universe is trying to return us to the nothing we came from. Maybe the Big Five were its best attempts to finish us off. Somehow, life always managed to survive just enough. Enough to thumb its nose at the will of the cosmos. You know, I'm starting to think that extinction might be the key to overcoming total annihilation. What, if you can harness it and then... It forces life to mm. fight to survive, to endure, Start afresh, but in a good way. That's why the Big Five ultimately rekindled life instead of extinguishing it. From the ashes of the dead, rise the living. Stronger. So, if you wiser, can find a way to survive it and maintain what you know, mm -hmm. 
They defy the universe and refuse to surrender. They say, we're just getting started. Extinction is an opportunity. I mean, that's putting a bit of a twist on it, but okay. Mm. Right now, there's not a lot we can do but just listen to you and agree. To try and get the heck out of here. Well, not necessarily agreeing. We're well, just listening uh, at this point. <laughs> well, I mean, if it means we get out of here, because otherwise we're stuck. Oh, okay. Even more tired. Is this the last uh, one? No, I think it's going to come along and put us back in the middle. It has. Oh. That's what happened the first time we did that. Gone too far. Yep. You've reached the edge. Okay, so just run around. Like that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Come on. Keep running. Keep running. Maybe not in the water because the scenes yeah. don't seem to happen in the water. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's walk along the, uh, run along the edge of the water. Why is nothing happening? Let's run up here again. That will happen. But he hasn't got through enough names in the credits yet. Yeah. <laughs> I definitely have to play this game again, I think, in my own time. Start again. See, I can't decide whether to start again and go through all the cutscenes and or whether to just do it in the post game. I guess you can see what the post game looks like. Yeah. You know, is it a case of like you could like redo stuff or is it just like the story's finished, just see if you can complete the rest of the deliveries of the roads and Yeah. Well that's stuff sort like of that. what I want to do, just build the world a bit more. Oh. I pulled the trigger twice that day. I knew at once I'd made a mistake. I found your beach and looked everywhere for you. Sam. There you are. Uh, uh, what? Is that the baby? She pulled the trigger twice that day. Who are you talking about? What? What the f- Am I the umbilical cord? Am I the extinction entity? Am I... BB? What? What? You wanna go home? Twice that day. Wait a sec, so she pulled the... She pulled the trigger twice that day. Bridget ordered... John to shoot Cliff and then did BB get born did she because we saw that scene with Cliff saying happy birthday you're going to mm -hmm. be born soon blah 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 are we BB uh, okay I'll, uh, let's just watch just listen I wanted, I wanted to set you free from death did you try to kill me you little bitch or BB She tried to drown me, the fucker. Is that why I have dooms? But in doing so, I upset the fundamental balance between life. Did the and fucker death. try to drown me? I just wanted to save you. Yeah, there's no other Amelies. Okay. entity it's my fate to lead our species to extinction but that moment you became part of that fate you became a repatriate and dooms started spreading my nightmares to others throughout the world i think that's what she means i think she it tried to drown me got you and everyone with dooms into this not long after the death stranding occurred Oop. the dead Clung to our world, and BTs used my beach to cross over and devour them, triggering more void outs. 
a catalyst that would set the world on a path to extinction. <sighs> it was my duty to serve as a sacrifice, to wait and watch it unfold from this beach. That, or hasten the last stranding and end this slow death. Given these, my only options, I chose to end it quickly. But to trigger the last stranding, I needed you, a part of me. Here too. I would be able to witness extinction consummated with you by my side. But now that you're here, there's another choice. You can cut me off. I'm doing it. An EE doesn't have that option for itself. But in my nightmares, I saw another future. One that you chose. One where extinction is hope against total annihilation. So she's going along saying about like, okay, the extinction stuff. Is that actually a better way for things to progress? Yes. In some ways, because like I say we could cut her off, but then we'll all ultimately die anyway. We can cut her off. The extinction is going to happen either way, but we can. She was either going to cause. End of the credits. What are we going to get? I'm rocking and soothing my BB. Do you want to back or am I continuing? You continue. I'm rocking and soothing BB in the hopes that he uh, stays He's settled slowing. for us. He's slowing. Auto save you bitch. <laughs> He's Please. holding the gun. He's holding the gun. Do Why it. is he holding the gun? Do it, Sam. A gun won't help you here. But it still has a role to play. What role? Shoot yourself. No, it's really sad. Do you want to reconnect Ooh. with the living? Okay, we had to sort the squishy out. Um, we are back. Had some time to think about what might be going on, what was happening there. I think that was to help us get in Amelie's mindset, Amelie Bridget's mindset, um, of what it was going to be like just being on the beach and why she maybe did what she did. Um, that said, I'm glad it's looking like it's ending and we're going to reconnect with the living. <laughs> There's nothing in oh, it. Oh no. We were gonna try to. Ugh. Shit. We can't get now. stuck on this beach. I me. was the one that brought you and Cliff together again. There was something I wanted you to know. You were never abandoned. And you're not alone. Don't you see, Sam? You have to live. Great, but. How? Oh! Ooh. Yeah, I see it too. Right, Squish, you need to stay asleep. For like, I don't know how long. This could go on for a little while, still. If you need me to do a cameo, I will do. Oh! oh. I'm gonna take it that they're friendly. Are they friendly? Don't know, but... Well, it's leading you in that direction, isn't yeah. it? Towards the... whatever they are in the sky. How many of us were there? Oh, it's... I'm here! I'm here! Oh, you! Oh, I thought your arm had disappeared there for a second. No, no, no! It's um, it's all the guys back in the real world. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm here. Teleport me! Oh, who's that on the beach? Bridget or Emily? And she's in a white dress. What's the significance of that? Don't give up. You're still connected. And I thought they were ominous at the beginning of the game. Mm -hmm. They're our friends.
Get me out of here! Yeah, please get me out of here. Gotcha! <laughs> Who was that? Was that Dead Man? It sounded like it might have been Dead Man. It did, didn't it? What's going on? Are you repatriating? Oh no, it is dead man. With BB! BB Blue. <laughs> right, okay. repatriation time. Over there, I'm guessing. Um, or not. There you go. Yep. Okay, stop the last stranding. We stopped Emily, and I was awesome. You didn't have to do anything. <laughs> well, we don't know. It may be that, like, could I have got a different outcome there if I'd not hugged Emily? Let us know. Okay, you hugged Emily. You did something. I did something. I could have stood there like a lemon. Instead, I tried to shoot her and then hugged her. <laughs> Not at all worrying, my darling. No. <laughs> For too long have we lived as strangers to one another. Divided by walls built to keep us safe. Is Die Hardman going to be like the, the new president? of the Cairo Network, <laughs> we may at last move forward as a people united. He's got his mask on again. Mm. Today we come together to celebrate the birth of a new nation. Oh, I think he would be a good president. A new nation he? for a new world. The United Cities of America. I was thinking about Fragile, but yeah, he would make mm. a good I candidate. I once took an oath to support and defend the Constitution of the United States. And though that proud republic may be no more, we remain. And so, as your president, oh. I hereby swear to support mm. and defend you, the people. Let there be no more walls between us, nor masks to hide who we are. Does that mean you're taking your mask off? I think he is, yeah. Well... Let there be a new America. An America where we can face one another. Where we can speak our minds and open our hearts. The old ways die hard. Uh, but I believe, my fellow Americans, that we have the strength and the courage to rise above our past and embrace our future. He seems like he'll be a good leader. A <laughs> <of that path. laughs> Hartman's just on the sofa An asleep. Yep. Well, in cardiac the arrest. Yeah. Of what could have been. Well, there He's he is. So that we stand here today is testament, not to the greatness of any one individual, but to our capacity to come together. So Hartman's still looking for his family the on the beach. Yep. Between us, to our collective greatness. All things must come to an end ourselves included but as long as we savor each moment find joy in the promise of tomorrow embrace hope and reject despair we will endure <laughs> president bridget strand and her daughter samantha america strand mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so we've maintained that in their lie looks like it that we, the people, might be whole again. That they are not here today to see the fruits of their labor fills us all with a profound sadness. But we find comfort in the knowledge that their memories will live on in the Cairo Network. Not sure how I feel about just and making our own course. version of events there. Hmm. To we start off a new state country there is another hero in this story 
One whose achievements seem destined to go unrecognized. I think he'd be happy with that. Mm -hmm. America still needs that. <laughs> that person without whom we would not be here. The name is unimportant. Oh, he's not going to name him. You know. Mm -hmm. And for that unsung hero, I have a message. It was you who brought us together. You who made us whole again. And while you and I will eventually... <laughs> he's just going to walk off. It's not for him, is it? Going the whole somewhere, terrorism thing. Mm -hmm. Yep. Tired of being the unsung hero? Yeah. No, I'm done is all. Oh. She's gone. Come on, wait. There's something I need to tell you. Huh. This doesn't bother you anymore? Oh. <laughs> well, that's <good>. <laughs> <laughs> Now, would you like to know how we brought you back from the beach? I don't know why that amused me so much. <laughs> yes, we how did you? To use the doll, but didn't have one handy. Did you use BB? Lou? something else. Think oh, the umbilical it. cord. Yes. What could be more connected to Amelie's beach than President Spram's Is umbilical? it my umbilical cord? Hartman thought that's why she left it with me in the first place. Unfortunately, it didn't work. Yeah, she'd already cut her beach loose. It was just gone. We didn't know if that meant she dragged you into the great beyond or sent you to some other beach. We were really racking our brains. Hartman and Mama split up and started searching every beach you might feasibly have washed up on. We looked for a month with absolutely nothing to show for it. That long? Wow. A month on the outside. How, How long, long on, on the, the inside? inside? Years. Trust me when I tell you, you don't want to know. But don't worry. We found no signs of accelerated aging. In the end, this oh. is what led us to you. Just when we were about to give up, Die Hardman reminded us about the revolver. So we tried to follow it, and it led us to a far corner of your own beach. And bingo, there you were. Mama made visual contact first. She was able to see you from her vantage point on the other side. She informed Lochna via their connection, and Hartman confirmed your location during his subsequent NDE. The plan was for Fragile to, in essence, slingshot <laughs> Lou and me to your position so we could rescue you. So it's a team effort. It's not so mm -hmm. easy to send multiple individuals to another person's beach for an extended period of time. And that's where the umbilical cord came in. We wove these from President Strand's DNA. They serve as a single knot that binds us all. The president must have known all of this would happen. Ironic, isn't it? The gun that set this whole mess in motion ends up being the key to saving you. I'm away. She said it had another purpose. Not a weapon, but a lifeline. I see Stick where they're going with all this. Going. Okay. <laughs> I suppose that's one way of putting it. <laughs> um, okay, dude. <laughs> it's like got something else to tell you. Top secret. Oh, it's about you. And why are you whispering? His name was Lisa Bridges, Cliff's common law wife. Lisa Bridges. Uh, now, Cliff was killed by a man identified <gasps> in the records only as John. Die Hardman. Mm -hmm. US Which we know. Forces. Quite good at it by all accounts. Later appointed as an aide to the president, who used him for most of her wet work. The records go on to state that he vanished after Cliff's death. A warrant was put out, but he was later found dead. Is he still a body? Out some people die harder than others, though. Die Hardman. <laughs> Dear John, donned a mask and reappeared with a new identity. But you can't fool the chiral network. We restored the old records. And Mama hid them deep in the archives. You're the only one besides us with access privileges. Take a look if you're so inclined. So we don't want him to be president. But don't He's still a bad guy. The president's got some. You were shifty hiding, laundry. hiding the real facts when you've started a new country, or you've 
I don't trust him. Restarted America again. Mm. Why would you lie about anything? We'll talk later. Um. Hi. Nothing to see here. Sam. Hello. Hi. I don't expect you to forgive me. But would you hear me out? I killed Captain Clifford Unger. I will tell you I did it for America. For love of country. But I didn't. I did it for her. I loved he loved her Bridget with all my heart. She was everything to me. Everything. Now I'm not trying to make excuses. I just want you to know that not a day's gone by when I haven't thought about it. Time didn't help. Or the mask. Please. Let me finish. He. The captain. Saved my life. Mm. You know why they call me Die Hardman. Because he wouldn't let me die. He brought my sorry ass back home every time. He's really conflicted about having killed him, isn't he? Mm -hmm. And I loved him. We tried to save him, didn't he? Based on one of BB's flashbacks. But he loved her more. As much as I loved her. <laughs> and when he stared me down, that ghost, I knew he was here to kill me, to make it right. And why shouldn't he? And I'm guessing he's forgiven you? And that's why, why you're here? Didn't he? To make he things right. Save his, his kid. His baby. And that's what brought him back. I guess when he... He saw I was trying... To do my part... For America. He remembered... Who he was. And he forgave me. But I don't deserve it, God damn it! There is no atoning for what I've done. Well, you can try. God, God. No. Sam's not vengeful, I don't think. No. But maybe. Maybe this is the next best thing. Maybe he brought me back from the beach for a reason. One last time. He wanted me to do this. Keep on being Die Hardman. No. He didn't. Oh. Nobody wants a president who acts like they're immortal. And if you're not scared of death, how can you value life? 
and life is pretty fucking fragile right now. And yeah, the old ways die hard. He's got the revolver. Okay, he is vengeful. Come together and build a better America. Oh wow! Didn't expect that. Response. Oh no, he's just giving it to him. Okay, I thought he'd actually stuck it against his stomach there. No, no, no but. That's quite a vengeful response. That's a mm. go. Thank you, Sam. Oh, I, I, I don't know. I think I need to rewatch that one again. What did you take from that one? Quickly, yeah, it was, a, it was a much stronger response than I thought he was going to come out with. But did he want him to kill himself or not? Anyway. Dead? <gasps> Poor thing was never truly alive. Not Aww. in this world, at least. The decommissioning order finally no. came through. Can't risk necrosis. The body can't stay here. I thought... You might want to take care of it. Oh no. This is the last you delivery. Could try isn't it? taking Lou out of the pod just to see what happens. But that would be in direct contravention of an executive order. And there are laws about that kind of thing. Now that we're a nation. I just couldn't bring myself to do it. But if the alternative is defying the president, I can't do that either. Not me. So you're gonna pass the book, are you? Pass it to us. All right. I'll go to the incinerator. Before you leave, I'd like to check something quickly. I just took your cufflinks offline. In that state, there'd be nothing to stop you from removing them. So what I can... If you did, the UCA wouldn't know where so you So I can go off grid. To find you. You'd be invisible. When you use the incinerator, you'll be reconnected to the network automatically. I trust you'll remember what I said. Right. Absolutely. So it's going to give you a chance to... to maybe defy them without them realising. Yeah, so how do I set this up then? My brain's just like, I'm trying to think logically, how do we set this up? Thanks for everything. Escape with BB, with Lou. gonna help us how's the weather don't think you'll be needing an umbrella oh good phew I decided to follow my father's dream after all don't worry I won't get mixed up with any terrorists this time could you see he's got my back we're the first private delivery company to get the official approval sounds like you're moving up in the world congratulations Thanks. Wait. There's something I have to tell you. I didn't shoot Higgs. Couldn't pull the trigger. So I let him choose. Mm -hmm. Death or eternal solitude on the beach. So he did it. Fair enough. You never did like breaking things. That's right. My find and fix was broken. 
and reconnect. I'm fragile. But not, not that, that fragile. fragile. <laughs> Wanna come work for me? Could use a man like you. Uh, I don't think it's gonna happen. The world's still broken. Same as before. What isn't? But we're still here. We're still chugging along. Not everyone. Not me. Come on. You put America back together, didn't you? Doesn't mean there's a place for me. I've got no ties to anyone or anything. I might as well be dead. I felt like that when we first We've met We've got the ties to Lou. I still do. But don't act like you're gone. Person. You've learned how to touch. I don't want to believe it. No, I know what you mean. You've connected with people. With us. Everything I touch, I lose. Sam! your save point it's now saved and i think we're going to save that one last delivery oh no order number 70 i don't want to do it i think we're going to have to save that for tonight but i think you guys are right we're going to leave it all in as one episode but in terms of recording it um we're going to pause there i can't believe that's ah oh, that sucks Hey, we're back. It's the evening time, so we're going to finish off this game. Um, I misunderstood a few things earlier, I think. I think I thought Sam was being quite vengeful towards Die Hardman, um, and I misinterpreted that whole giving him the gun thing. I think, actually, he was telling him to, like, basically be a good president type thing, uh, and that um, Bridget slash Amelie had... Oh, it would have been Bridget, will not it? Because mm -hmm. he was yeah. in love with Bridget. I think Sam was trying to say, Bridget said that there'd be another use for this gun. Go forth and make her proud type thing. Um, which I think we sort of didn't quite get at the time. It would explain why he was like, thank you, Sam. Yes, exactly. He was, he was grateful <laughs> that we weren't a dick to him, basically. Yeah, anyway, we so thought he was being... Oh. I'm sorry, I've been talking too long, haven't I, Sam? Right, yeah. um, I'll, I'll stand up. Um, but now we've got this awful task of getting BB to the incinerator and I don't seem to have a map Whoa. this is on me I don't have a map that's odd oh god can I check him check on Lou oh, I can't I soothe him That's hit me in the feels. Not gonna, oh god, I'm gonna need tissues for this bit. Look, Sam's upset too. Okay. Um. BB steam. It's sunset here too. Yeah. Am I going the right way? I'm not sure you are. We have more chance going that way because yes it specifically lets you out the front doesn't it it doesn't let you just walk out anywhere mm. very easily mm. i want to know if there's going to be any other sort of unexpected twists or anything like that, I mean... Oh, I, I'm going the wrong way here, aren't I? I feel like you might have done this before. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so... I 
didn't know that those words, that's what it meant. I think I can climb up here. It's a good job, really. Oh god, this song. Like, when you listen to the lyrics. Off we go. One last trip with him. I'm gonna be in tears by the time we get up this freaking mountain. Hmm. Can we remember the way? It's up here. I really hope that we can, you know what, we're monetized but I don't care, I'm going to leave this track in, even if we don't make money from it because you guys need, well you'll have heard this, but this song needs to stay in. It's definitely there for a reason isn't it? Mm -hmm. So what, what's Sam going to do? I mean, he was saying to Fragile that he... Oh, there's a ladder there. <laughs> of course. Poor Ego, Rip Ego. Yeah, I'd be interested to know what he's going to do as well. I mean, he's off. He's off. Uh, well, he's invisible right now because his cufflinks are deactivated yeah. right now. Because he was basically saying to Fragile, I've got no reason for, for being... Yeah, he said he didn't have a place in this world anymore, did he? And that, you know, he hasn't got a reason to to live. Like, I, I feel like Lou would have been one. Yep. So it's just a case of what is he actually going to do? Oh, the incinerator's round here. I've done the same thing I did way back when, haven't I? Oh well, for all time's sake. Leaping across the rocks, at least just, you don't have to do it with like a massive load of cargo on you. Yeah. We don't have a map. It's expecting us to remember. Yep. I thought it popped up on, as an objective point, like on your, your HUD. So look, it's saying left, the arrow points for left. There it is. Yeah. So it's not okay. leaving you completely by yourself. Oh, but... It's just so awful. I've even got the BB. I've even got BB's little face down there. Yep. Music, please come back, it's far too quiet. And I'm too sad. Up you go. I've no idea where this is going, but I... I, I don't see how it's going to be good. Seeming unlikely that there's going to be any happy ending at the end of this. There it is. Yep. And I don't think there's any BTs at the moment. From what Fragile was saying, I took that to mean, you know, it's fine. There's no rain. You can just run there. Yep. Mm. 
seems like a very long time since I was here. Yep. Getting freaked out by my first massive Oh yes, PT. I remember that. <laughs> What's he gonna do? All right. I guess we're here. You still with me, Lil? Poor thing was never truly alive. Not in this world, at least. We're we gonna get a choice. He's gonna plug Thanks himself in. Second, all this is over. I'm going to take you wherever you want to go. This isn't what we agreed on. You said you'd do everything in your power to save Bibi. We are. But we cannot release your son just yet. Believe me when I tell you it's for the best. Is this a woman in a mask who's done nothing but lie to you? know that feeling. Mm. I have a duty to protect our country. Lies are an unfortunate necessity. So that's Sam, right? Because Cliff's the dad. Gave me the highest level access privileges. So Sam is Luke. I've used them to manipulate the security system. We have five minutes before it resets, sir. Five minutes to talk. Off the record. Take BB. It's weird that we're There's seeing this I now. For your wife. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. From this perspective. Yeah. You were my commanding officer, but I swore an oath to the president to protect her and the country at all costs. Now, if she orders me to do something, I have to do it. I have to. But I served under you first. And your family doesn't deserve this. So why are Any we seeing this? this again? Well, I was thinking back think? when we were talking to Die Hardman. But they can't said about how Cliff forgave him. You saved my life, sir. Because of this. Because again of this. and again. When the brass sent us into the jaws of hell, it was you that brought us home. Back then, I thought I was invincible. 
I thought I was some kind of action hero. But I'm not the hero. You are, sir. You're the reason I'm still alive. And it's past time I paid that debt. They're moving your son to a new facility tomorrow. You'll never see him again. He'll serve as the foundation of a new communications network. A sacrifice for a nation that no longer exists. That's awful when you put it like that. Yep. I wrote down everything you need to know. It was the only way to keep it off the system. So he tried. He did. Burn it when you're done. The rest is up to you, sir. So that, that is Sam. So then... I think I'm just getting all kinds of confused with the BB, Lou, Sam thing. Are Sam and Lou different BBs? Or do we not know? I believe this belongs to you, sir. Now, I can't terminate your wife's life support from inside her room. The system won't allow it. So, this is the only other option. Alarm is set to go off if she flatlines. I've rigged the system to spoof her vitals. But you won't have long. Five minutes, Tops. Don't hesitate, sir. This is the only chance you'll get. Sorry, Lisa. Don't worry. I'll take care of him. I promise you. I promise you.
Um. Right. So. Uh, and there's your new objective. So is BB? BB is a different entity, isn't he? From us. Must be. I believe so. I think I'm getting confused because there's this the astronaut thing. Mm -hmm. That's obviously being passed around, and we had that. Sam had that at one point, and then now BB's got it. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I don't want to. I I'd be exactly the same. just took your cufflinks offline. In that state, there'd be nothing to stop you from removing them. If you did, the UCA wouldn't know where you were or how to find you. Burn the cufflinks. You'd be invisible. When you use the incinerator, you'll be reconnected to the network automatically. Burn those. You could try taking Lou out of the pod just to see what happens. That would be in direct contravention of an executive order. How are we going to look after him, though? I mean, what? Is that it? I don't know. So, so we put BB in and we didn't take him out. Or did we? What's going to happen now? You didn't see him disappear. You think he's going to wait till the cufflinks are like almost in and then leg it out with BB or something? Let's something wait and like see. That? Oh, please say we're going to do something. Go on, Sam. Yes. A purpose that cannot fulfill outside the pot. There is a 70% risk of catastrophic failure simply in removing it. You've got to take that risk. Back we go. We're going to see the rest of that scene. We're going to see Cliff getting shot again. I think. Are we? Oh. Hang on. This is like the repatriating oh. thing. But in the... <gasps> in the hospital. And what's uh, that thing that's hovering mm, above? Mm. What's that hovering above? Lisa. Or is that just like... Oh, I was the top of the... Um, what do you mean? It's I, the yeah, I saw, thing. No, I thought it, I saw something here. I thought it was something floating. It's not. Um, what am I meant to be doing here? I don't know. Are you going to repatriate in Lisa? I don't know. Is she a repatriate? No. Okay. Can you go uh, out the door? The door's open. Do I need to go and find Cliff? <gasps> yeah. Is this is this um how I how Sam gets his Doom's ability? It was it from Lisa? I think it might be from Lisa. Oh, okay, no. There you are. Because normally, you go to... Did Lisa pass it on to me then? And can oh, Sam shit. and can Sam pass it on to be uh, to Lou? Maybe. Maybe. Oh God! Please say yes. Is that is is Cliff 
Is Cliff trying to show me stuff? Or is L Lou trying to show me stuff so that I can... No, that's not Lou, is it? Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm so confused. Are we getting shown stuff to try and help us out? Maybe. To try and sort of correct a wrong that happened in history. Do you know what I mean? Hmm. There's the alarm. Shit. Freeze! Hey! Put it down! Drop it! Put it down! Back off. Hmm. Back off! Get up! Don't do it! I'll handle this. Bide us some more time. Looks like it. Oh. He's taken a bullet already, hasn't he? Does he do something with? Don't. You got it. With the BB. You two. Stay there. And hold your fire. Does he manage to switch him or something so that Sam somehow survives? <gasps> hmm. Clever. Trying to work out if he's still trying to help or not. I think he is. He's trying to do something, isn't he? God. Sorry, I keep just hypothesizing. It's just what? if I wait until the end of all this, I'm going to forget what I was thinking at the time. So I, I hope you don't mind. He's back here. One way. So Sam's is he actually Sam there? Is... Has something gone on with our Doom's ability repatriation? Are we time travelling? Are we actually there? Trying to work that out. They didn't seem to react to uh, they Sam didn't, they in the didn't. window. There. Are we just watching? Is it just artistic license? You think that Cliff would have seen him yeah, when true. he came in? Yeah, yeah, true. I'm sorry, Lisa. I screwed it up. I've ruined everything. Don't worry. It's okay. I'll 
always been with you. See the sunset, the day is ending. Let that yawn out, there's no pretending. I will hold you and protect He's not there. But wait. So it wasn't John that shot Cliff? He's still alive. Did he have to fire the last shot? Did he fire shot? the last Cliff, shot? No, no, no. Be yeah, because you see that angle, don't you? The weird I angle. Was so Same mistake. Be yourself. Be free. Oh my god. She's taken him uh, he's taken him out. Yep. Captain. I need you. To hand it over. Shoot him, John. Let it go. Please. Shoot him. I gave you an order. Shoot him. You told me your name was Sam Porter. <gasps> what? Sam Bridges. My son. My bridge to the future. Without you, I was just like any other cliff. It's the only thing I was ever good at.
What is going on? Good on you, Sam. <sighs> you bring people together. You and their bridge. You're the future. Why is he going to somehow Sacrifice time travel him. to the future? I don't know. I, I don't know what is gonna happen. Well his bridge to the future I've just taken from that. What is this how Sam survives? And are we are we gonna save Lou? Is this me? I'm so confused. Yes. So all that time, you've been fighting your dad in the battlefields. Yeah. Well, you've just realised that Cliff is Sam's dad. I just had that but I okay. and, and Bridget. Okay. As just. Sorry, I thought that. you'd realised. That may be too. <gasps> Oh my god. And Bridget was the one had ha, ha. Oh dear God. Bridget just did that. What do you mean Bridget just did that? Did you not see? She was holding John's hand with the gun. Right. So I think she's forced him to shoot. Shit. So that's why I said she's done that. I need to watch that again. That went too quick. I know, quick. it's like... It's... Sorry, I thought you realised that Cliff was Sam's dad. I'd twigged a couple of episodes ago. I hadn't twigged. Right. You I was there thinking, did you know more than I did from something? But I right. hadn't twigged. Obviously, that's the big sort of confirmation in case you haven't realised it. But that's why I was sort of asking certain questions about Lou and BB. I'm trying to work out how they all fit together. Mm-hmm. And I still don't really understand, and you're probably all screaming at me like, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> they found you on the beach. So that's how Sam survived. Sam. You mean? Well... Amelie found me. There you are. And raised me on the beach. Am I not real? Oh, God. Oh. Of course. So she. Emily has magic powers. Healed that... me. Made me into a repatriate. That's baby Sam. My God, okay. Raised me as her own. Oh shit, okay. That's why that scene Let's happens. Go. So she didn't try to kill me. She sent you back. She sent you back to the real world. From the beach. Yep. But that's how I got my powers, my abilities maybe. Mm-hmm. From that whole weird as fuck experience. So I had it completely wrong, because every time you clipped into BB, I thought you were going into BB's memories. Clearly you were going into Sam's BB well, memories. Well, yeah, I did yeah. as well. I thought I thought yeah. BB was Lou. That's why I'm sort of like, well, who's, who's Lou? Because he's got the little 
key ring as well. Mm -hmm. So I was getting him confused with Sam. BB Sam. So is this going to get explained, how Lou is linked to it all? Oh, that's the little icon from the beginning, isn't it? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I guess this is you back. As a BB again. Or is it. Wait, wait. Is this Lou? There you are. Welcome back. Welcome back. You understand his days as a BB are over. Now that his connection to the other side has been severed. Okay, so this is Sam. Mm hmm. It was me who cut the cord. So, yes. A stepless repatriate in the world of the living. Should we decommission? No. That's why she raises him as her own. She feels guilty. In a manner of speaking. Take him out of the pod. I'll raise him as my help. So that was coming from a place of guilt. Yep. I think. Wanting to make amends. Hmm. There go your cufflinks. So after all that. God, this is such he's a, a he's mind taking fuck. him out. He's taking him out. Is he okay? Oh, this is such a mind fuck, guys. I'm sorry about my stream of consciousness. I'm sorry if I haven't twigged things that were obvious from before. It's fine. It's confusing. Oh, oh, what's going on? Oh, Sam. Come on. Come on. Come on, wake up. Yes, come on. Up. Please. Wake up. Come on, please. Is this his connection to the other side? Looks like it. Is he becoming a BT? <laughs> god damn it. Oh my oh. god. Okay, okay. I said, just give Sam this one thing. Ew. What's that? <laughs> Aha! Oh. oh, you guys were right. <laughs> you said this was going to be emotional. <laughs> mm -hmm. I may not show it as much, but it's there on the inside. So, did those other. Why the other BT babies? Did they help him? Stay on this side? Uh, rain? As in time fall or normal rain? I don't know. He's walking around without his hood on. He is. So... And those were white BT type BBs, so... Has th have things changed? Looks like it, because he's not ageing. BB looks okay. Sorry, blue. Blue. And it's getting sunny all of a sudden.
Unless we've both died. I hope not. I hope we're living.
Oh, I think that's a great game. It's a great story. And I don't think it should have been a movie. Um, mm -hmm. I know he's talking about going into movies and stuff. I think it was a great game. Yep. I'm tempted to try it, maybe, in my own time. Maybe. There's more. So who's that woman, the the pregnant woman? That was... Oh. <laughs> well, that was his partner, wife, Please. whoever who... <gasps> it's a Ooh. girl! Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Lou's a girl! Oh, God damn. There we were thinking the whole time. That can't be right. I didn't wear any footwear out. Or did I change it before it ran out? I'm guessing you must have changed it. Or Tumble the I don't believe that either. Tumble's taken 14. Is that all? I mean, you didn't end up falling over that much. Total water ingested. Where's that? The third thing down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, I actually built 35 things. Congratulations. Almost 40 hours of playtime. Is it only 40 hours? Felt like longer, but I suppose we have been playing this on and off for several months now, haven't we? Yeah. Okay. 15 road sections restored. Yeah. Really? As many as well, that? Well, not just by me. I think that's just within my game with help from other people. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Um, that would make sense. Louise! Fucking hell. Five hundred and thirty eight connections made with other players. You received thirty seven thousand seven hundred and ninety one likes, apparently. Sixteen thousand of which were from other players. Thanks for everything. Yeah, same. Oh god, BBC, I'm not gonna be listening to that hmm. after this. I need to read all of these things as well. Yep. Wow. I need to get back into this game. <laughs> yeah, around the photo, um, there was a hint at one point about his partner and, you know, who's carrying his child that got caught up in something. They did in a void out, yes. Yeah. That's right. Episode 15, tomorrow's in your hands. Post game. Two weeks earlier. So I'm guessing we're going to get. Go back in time, get BB back. Yeah. Still sleeps like that. Oh, look at that, your cufflinks are back. Good morning, Sam. Blood collection. Ah, because was chapter 14 or episode 14, wasn't that a month after? Well, look who's awake. Morning, Sam. Morning. You'll be happy to hear your vitals have stabilized. <laughs> yeah. well on your way to recovery. A massive whale. Ha. Not that it's your fault, but what I wouldn't give to trade places. We're all stuck in the president's office, working like yep. dogs to get everything ready in time for the inauguration. But at least one of us is still free as a bird. You should head out. Make the most of it. Could even do some orders if you wanted. Might do you good to get back in the game. <laughs> you may recall it was raining buckets back when you yeah. were on Amelie's beach. What's happened now? We took a real beating at the time, but we've done our best to service the structures and vehicles in the area. So you know, any cargo that was stored in your private locker at a damaged facility should have been transferred to your private locker here at this district. Okay. Center. Anyway, busy or not, we'll still be on the end of the line if you need us. And if you want some alone time, we should be able to manage for now. Just make sure you're back in time for the big day, all right? See you then. Okay. Hey, Sam. You sure you don't have any unfinished business? There's plenty of unfinished business. Past time until the presidential inauguration. Well. Well. There you go. I got shitloads of likes and I'm pretty much back in. Yep. 
Um, and I can carry on doing stuff. You're checking on Lou. I'm checking on Lou. One last time. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm so glad you survived. You okay? <laughs> Although, of course, that's in t two weeks in the future. It is, but I'm so, so happy they didn't kill you. Mm -hmm. Ah, right. Well, now I guess it's just up to me to carry on the game and build more roads. Keep on keeping on. Yep. Thank you so much for joining me and Sherbs in this Let's Play. Um, yeah, it's just, it's been a blast. It's taken a while. It's taken six months. So really, thanks for bearing with me. Um, I've had a great time. Um, but yeah, till next time, well, whatever it is we're playing, I don't know. Um, yeah, see you then. Bye. See you.